Transitions is an exhibition and it's also a process. We've come together in four different countries to discuss our post-conflict transitional justice journey. Some of us are 150 years into the transitional justice process and some of us are really trying to get to a post-conflict scenario. Having this workshop has opened our minds to different countries who have gone either to a, a transition or has gone through a peaceful process, hearing the experiences from Bosnia, from Congo, and the U.S., we, there are some underlying themes that, that overlap with us. And, you know, it's in South America, but it's so close to an American audience, it sometimes people forget the things that we've gone through. We're part of this international team. We're really proud of it. And this has been a very important experience for us because it's not usual to have like this kind of opportunities to share stories about conflict. be a window, local people talking about themselves. At the same time, uh, an occasion to bring all these different experiences around the world, put it together and exchange the best practice from each country. So I think it's a wonderful idea. For us at Yole Africa, there's a particular benefit in bringing our work into international contexts. We're very interested in sharing with global audiences the realities that are taking place in Congo and creating invitations and possibilities for people who are concerned about this to get involved in ways that are positive, that are empowering, that have to do with mutual exchange. had the opportunity to take a part in telling the story of Bosnia's transition um, after this recent genocide. We wanted to take an approach trying to show the process that is still ongoing. Uh, this was a big experience for me to meet people from other countries, to hear their problems in their country, how they try to solve it. I can use their experience in my storytelling. One of the things that we've learned through this workshop in Chicago, you can build solidarity by opening up this exchange and making it an international topic. It allows more people to freely engage, um, perhaps with less intimidation um, and a bit more interest and curiosity. A lot of the work that I've provided focuses on race relations in America. I think it's really important to understand historically why we are in the same situation that we were in years ago and understand that journey we've had. When we understand how systematic um, oppression has affected different groups, that's when we realize what needs to be done now. Um, so I want people walking away from this with the desire to work together. That's when we'll really see changes. We would like people to come to the exhibition or access it online and to feel that there are tools out there for justice. And hopefully this all comes together to give this very dynamic vision of what transitional justice is and why it matters to the individuals that live in a society.